have a very special video for you today. We're taking Tron fishing. He's about to show up. I got my oatmeal, my lunchbox, and hopefully we're gonna catch some bass. We're on Lake Greenwood. Stay tuned. Push it to the limit, I can't go no more. Yo, Zuri was in the face. Guys, I have a very special guest today. I want to introduce you to him. His name is Tron. You can find him at the real Sparkle City Bassin on Instagram. Let's interview him real fast and see what his story is. Hi, everybody. Like you said, my name is Tron. Oh, uh, so I've had cancer three different times. Once when I was six, 11, and recently when I was 20. So probably wondering why I'm on option. So over the years, like, the cancer affected my lungs. And this past winter, my brother came home with the flu. He just started daycare. Don't recommend daycare. And over time, I guess I w didn't have the strength to cough up the mucus. So it gave me a small bit of pneumonia. But over time, as I got my energy back and started moving around, it's getting better. So when I was six, I had osteosarcoma, which is a bone cancer. And then I had a total knee replacement in Atlanta. After that, about, let's see, I was around 11, so five years later, I had a relapse to leukemia, which is a cancer of, I think, white blood cells, yeah. I'm not saying. So, so I had to get a bone marrow transplant for that, which my mom was the donor. Shout out to you, mom. Uh, so went through that for like a year and some change. And then I developed a chronic lung disease, which gave me the lung problems. And then I had to have another knee surgery, but it was too long. So they were afraid my lungs would collapse. So I had to get a knee, knee amputation, above knee amputation. So then I had to be in a wheelchair. <laughs> then after that, I developed skin cancer on my lip and I had to get radiation from that. So hopefully we're done. <laughs> Let's pray that we're done. Man, God bless you, Tron. But, but through all this, fishing has kept him solid, right? Yeah, yeah. You love fishing. That's awesome, man. Well, God bless you, Tron. Thanks for coming out and fishing with me. Thanks. We love you, dude. Love you, too. Yeah, we about to have a good day. All my people down the ride, turning up into the sky. That's fast. Yeah, I'm about to break it down, baby. I get everything you want, really, just to get a smile real tough. Boy, I get it for my people. Like that? Yep. It's perfect. You ready? Yep. One, two, three. Here you go, bud. This goes in the back? Yeah, just hanging on the back. Which side do you want it? Around your shoulder? Don't matter. It doesn't matter. All right. Perfect. There you go. 62.8 is the water temp. When was the last time you got to go fish on a boat? Oh, uh, maybe like a month ago. Oh, sweet. I caught them on a couple points last time I was here. I hope that they show up. Man, there was there's stripers on them right now. And I hit one of them the other day and... Got them. Bass. First one, Tron. Or is it a striper? Spotted bass? Yep. Oh, we got spots here. First one. Breaking the ice. You were right. Next selfie was with a fish. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I love smelling fish. I love smell. Oh, yeah. I love that smell. <laughs> My mom's not too fun of it, though. She was scared of that boat. I know that. Oh, she was really scared when I hooked that big fish. Ooh, got him. Nice, Tron. 
large mouth. Large mouth. Tron's hooked up. First fish on the top, Yozuri top water. Bring him to me, Tron. Oh, it's a good one. What is spot? Is this spot? That's a large mouth. Bring him here, maybe back your rod up a little bit. There he is. Yes, sir. Nice. Yozuri in his face. I'm stuck. <laughs> He had it good. You want to take a picture with him? Sure. Awesome. First outwater fish of the year. Awesome. Video. Say something cool. Joe Zuri was in the face. Awesome, dude. Let him go. Tron's first bass. What's that? Say, it didn't even have to twitch it twice. I, I know it. Twitch what? Boom. <laughs> That was awesome. Oh, I love top water. You call. Yeah. Did you get it? <laughs> Tron is just reeling them in. That's a spot. Yep. Heck yeah. On the Yozuri. Tron, I'm stealing this from you for the tournament. <laughs> I'm gonna send you a bunch more. <laughs> you think I'm playing? You're probably the only pro I give it to. <laughs> Look at his little spotty dog. Get him in the water. <laughs> he said, yeet. Good job, Tron. Get you no, know, I can't even do nothing. You just freaking catching him. Let's go back through that stretch again. See if we get a couple more. I'll flip you around. He guess he like he hit it and just ran, huh? Yeah. Oh, Tron, they're up there on that bank, son. I watched him come out and get it. Throw yours up there. Look what he did in my bait. How'd right you know? here. Right, right there by that other rock. Got him! Tron got him! That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Spotted dog. They're so mean when they hit it. Aggressive. I know. <laughs> love to see it. You gotta love to see it, you know. Oh, he's all over. They're all over it, Tron. They're nipping it. He's a cartwheel. Dude, look how he sucked it. Sucked it so hard, it went, look at that, I've never seen this. <laughs> he tied it in a knot. There was a whole wolf pack of them, Tron. I thought it wasn't even his mouth at first. Crazy. There was a bigger one with him, naturally. The little one got it. <laughs> I can see him on the surface, so right back at the kind of centerpiece of that dock right there. Like that. <laughs> That's not a bad one. Textbook. That's a nice spot. Nice spot, Tron. Ooh. He got the main hook too, boy. He didn't even need that treble. <laughs> See, those are the spots we like to catch. Those are good ones. <laughs> the guy at the bank was said they like watermelon red here. I heard that. That's a good one. As soon as I put that treble hook on, Tron, <laughs> they just eat it. And big ones, too. I oh, know. Oh, he's been caught a bunch. Boy, that is so He's spawning. Look at me. <laughs> Come here, give me some confidence to throw the flute tomorrow. Thanks, Phil. Care me? Oh, there's a bunch of them up there, Tron. Right in that little inlet, like right, yeah, they're right in there. 
there you go. Let it sink just a little bit. And then, yep, they've been, it's, they've been biting it just to right where you can't see it. Oh gosh. Got him. <laughs> That's active target all the way, all the way. Looks like a better one. Oh yeah, it's a good one, Tron. Good job. Good job. Active target fish. I said, Tron, throw it over there. And he did, and guess what? He got him. Got another large one? Yep. Yep. I gotta get your line, bud. Right, I'm gonna go down here. Perfect. We got a rhythm now. That hooked it good, didn't it? There's your bass. We're gonna take a selfie with your bass now. How about that? I like it. Uh, then it was like bluegill spawn. Oh, so yeah. So we were like doing shallow. Oh, my God. Oh, gosh. That's a big one. Big spot. Or a striper. Striper. <laughs> They followed you to Greenwood. But yeah, we threw like shallow crankbaits all day. And that morning we threw poppers. How about that for a release? Quick release. Oh God. You get a bite? Yeah. I like you just had to tell. Yeah, sometimes I just come up and swipe at it, you know? Oh my gosh. <laughs> be hitting it that many times. We need to stay right here for a second. Let me see if I can get him. <laughs> Was that on camera? <laughs> if I can get him. Oh my God. Blooper. I almost dropped my line broke. And luckily I threw my rod in. If it had been out there, your boy would have been diving in. I stopped seeing fish over here, Mr. Tron. Oh, I got a big vibe, really, but it's fitting for two. No, I mean, well, I don't really mean it for you. Unless you my guy, my friend, my sis, my friend, my friend. Oh. We're doubled up. Yes, sir. We doubled up. Yes! He choked it. Choked. Look, I got mine because of the treble, Tron. Look. That's what I'm talking about. Double trouble. Let him dangle. Let him dangle. See, guys? A little tip for you. Treble hook. Caught that bass. But he been caught before, Tron. He's stupid. Might have been one we caught earlier. It might have been. This one's got a brush pile on the end of this point. That's what all those fish were sitting on earlier. Kind of right there where that dock's kind of ending, tapering. Right in there, there's a bunch of them. They're still falling, man. They swam back now. Might have to go sight fishing now, we'll see. If they don't want to keep buying. Oh crap! Wow. All the way back to the boat. That's crazy. That's I cool. Even, I didn't even get a good look at him. He sounded big. Yeah, it was, it was a decent fish. You were trying to take it, he, he thought it was going to get away from him. <laughs> if he would have grabbed that right in the boat and got it, I probably would have had a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Got him, Tron. Nice. This feels like a big one. It's a, it's a better fish. No, it's a giant. No, it's not. It's a really strong spot. <laughs> Look at him fight. He's digging hard, isn't he? It's strong. Ate it. All right, guys, I'm going to tell you how we're catching him today. We've only needed one bait and one bait only, and that's been a Zoom Super Fluke 
It's been phenomenal. I'm, we're throwing it two different ways. We got two tricks we've kind of pulled out to, to catch these bass. For the spinning rod, I rigged Tron up. It's got an owner uh, cover shot. It's one used for like a drop shot or a light Texas rig. And uh, basically just thread it on like you would a swim bait. And when it dies, it kind of rolls over like that. But the hookups on a spinning reel are phenomenal. Uh, super sharp hook. And the, the key cadence was just kind of twitch, twitch and letting it pause, right, Sean? What, what was, what, you kind of figured that out, right? Yeah, so I figured out, because they kept eating it when I would pause it, and I would just lift up and they would be there. So I figured out if I pause a little bit longer, just when you, after, once you cast it, just when you pick up, they're there, so. Yeah. Yeah, he had the, both of the big fish today. It was like a, a large mouth, about two and three quarter, and then had a three pound spot of bass. Yes, sir. And we've never been, he's been here a few times, but he's, he's never been to this end of the lake, and I've never been there. Um, uh, there, here at all. It's mm -hmm. Lake Greenwood, right? Yeah. Yep, so we're, I was in my off day at Lake Murray, but my, and my setup was the Zoom Super Fluke, and I had it Texas rigged, but I was missing a lot of fish, so I put a Stinger treble on the backside, and basically, how you rig it, I'm gonna take it out of the tail real fast, is you gotta do the normal Texas rig, and, and you, you want a thread that's a number six treble hook, round bend, and then I take the treble hook, and I take the barb and I just shove it through the fluke in the back. So you kind of, the top hook's kind of sticking out and then the two stingers are just right back behind that hook. And I caught several today just on those trebles and it definitely put more fish in the boat. But if you guys want to catch more bass during the sh herring spawn, what should they throw? A fluke. We uh, the bet. Fluke, that's right. All right, we're gonna keep catching them. Sounds like a spring morning. Birds chirping, bass busting. Peacocks making noise. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, had one. Nice. Nice, Tron. That's not a bad. Thought about it. You're fine. God, he choked it, Tron. That fluke is gone. Mm -hmm. It's gone. Hi, how you doing? I got a fish. Good morning. Oh, that's, that's a big, big one. That's a good one, Tron. That's a giant. Can't see it. That's a oh, Tron, it's a big one. <laughs> oh yeah, that's it. That is it, Tron. That is what we're talking about. Oh, I smushed my oatmeal. I stepped in it. My lunch, my <laughs> breakfast is done. That's your fish, dog. That might be my biggest spot here. Really? I thought he was a giant large mouth. I bet. <laughs> that is awesome. Let me get your picture, bud. I'll gladly give up that oatmeal for you. Take that, Dustin. <laughs> yes, sir. Here. I mean big and got little on Ten. this one. Yeah, where, where is the is it gauge at? Just does it kind of have a level? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like a PSI level. Yeah. Oh, hello! Saw him grab it. Tron is dialed. Got the technique down. And they're all choking. They are eating it. You, they like your technique. You're just kind of slow twitching it. Choked it. <laughs> nice. Sorry, Tron. You did. 
Our rods point the opposite ways. <laughs> I instantly switched to the slow twitch like Tron. Got him on the treble hook. Nice. Our poor rods. <laughs> I said I was going to say left, but I didn't. That's a bad one. Treble hook again. <laughs> Treble. Let me check this tank here. What's the, is it the number on it? Uh, it's like a gauge. Oh, and I see it. It's got red and green. I'll give it like a couple more minutes. All right. Catch, catch that fish. <laughs> we are on them. Bet he's got it choked too. Oh, just the outside of the mouth. That hook gets them good drawn. Nice fish, dog. We are catching him. He's cold. He is cold. Give him a, give a good yip. So what do we do here, Tron? So we grab these keys out of here. Take my breath first if I turn this off. You unscrew this. I'll put this tape down. Now line these two holes up on the side and right. cut it back on. And we're good. Oh, give me Nice. Guess we made a good move, Tron. Most definitely. Let's go hit this other point back here. Should be able to idle to it pretty quick. Get him, Tron. I'll get you a little closer. Bet there's one under that shade under that dock. You got one? That's a good one. Oh yeah, baby. First cast. Come off at the boat. Man down. I was really in to make another K. Were you really? Look at that guy. Give him a pet. There you go. Bye. First cast on the new spot. That's how all fishing trips should be. Come out and whack them. All right. We, we good. <laughs> they gon' always be the whole lot of my life. Everything I do is all for them. Ay. Anything I want, I cop for them. I want the best life. But ain't nothing gonna be right if you just left mine. All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe. Hit that like button. And Tron, what are your social medias? Uh, My YouTube is Sparkle City Bassin. And my Instagram is the real Spark City Bassin. And my TikTok is just Spark City Bassin with two exclamation points. Go follow Tron. We'll put it up on the screen right here. Thanks so much for hanging out. We love you guys. And until next time. We'll see you. See you. Peace. All right, Tron. Got a surprise for you. Do I need to close my eyes? Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> I signed it this morning for you. It's my jersey this year. Cool. Dang. Yeah, brother. There you go. Get a frame for it or hang it up, whatever. I do have these little pop little boxes. Uh, you can frame them. It's pretty cool. That's all. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. And uh, <laughs> that's yours. Hey, son, the head.